So yes, finally, finally, finally! Though of course I'm back with another really quick. Ooh, ooh, of course, uh, Sonic video. So yeah, it seemed a little bit drained out and tired because I did record like four videos already. Today's my fifth one. I did record like four shorts. It's like, yay, I'm done. And I was like, I had to check for Sonic news. Just in case, and I feel so stupid though. So I'm gonna make this video probably pretty quick as I can. Do the guys love Sonic stuff, I know they can be quick and fast. Ah, just like Blue Blur himself. Blue Blur himself. Blue Blur. 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 Yeah, of course. You gotta do Japanese Pacific tours, of course, coming for Sonic Prime. It seems like the merchandise is coming up soon though. So it's really cool and stuff like that. Of course, it seems like, um, the official merch for Wild Brains upcoming Sonic Prime animation. Of course, there's new cartoons coming out. I think later this year, I think in December, I can't remember honestly, it's been so long, so all that. I think since like, what, end of 2020, I think, yeah, because that's the last time I went over back in like December of 2020. Oh, uh, we got more news like here and there, so about that, like, I mean, no, not really, actually, no, not really. So, yeah, I forget what I just said there, but yeah. The new Muscle Mario Sonic cartoon, the other typical stuff, though, so of course we got new plushies, vehicle sets. Also, of course, this is a prime example of, you know, but this is what we have in Tech Pacific 2021. I remember going over this in the video. I was like, oh, wait, I already did a video for this. But yeah, I remember doing this for, this, for the Sonic Mini I set that I went over it and stuff like that. It wasn't that bad. I said that was pretty cool itself, though. So, um, yeah, it's pretty cool. Um, but yeah, uh, we got that. Um, of course, like I said, um, for 2021 April. I never remember going over that, though, of course. But yeah, it seems like there's going to be making merchandise for Sonic Prime. Costumes, it seems like that. I think I saw it somewhere up here. Costumes, of course, they got a contract because, you know, again, Sonic Prime, it's man of action, of course. You know, like they, they don't own it, though, but they, you know, are the producers of the show, though. So they got to kind of, you know, kind of keep it around there. You know, it's going to be, you know, basically based on, like, you know, like so action figures, uh, plushies, vehicles, and stuff like that. Which actually is pretty cool because I didn't see that before at all, though. So, yeah, probably different form because, again, like I said, it's going to do a time travel, like, like you know, different dimensions. So we're going to have probably like, different, um, you know, like a dimension blast or like Sonic or something like that. For pop vinyls, that's going to be insane because we got like 30th anniversary pop vinyls, like little figures you can collect, like vinyl figures you can collect, like almost every series, like Spider Man, um, you know, like the Marvel with Heroes, you know, like Black Panther, I think. Uh, like in game has like some of that stuff already, so that's pretty cool. So, yeah, again, little stuff like that. Again, like th those are like all gold, I think, though. But, yeah, little stuff like that, of course, though, is actually all pretty cool, though. Again, I think it's all really cool, all really great, though. So, yeah, uh, I'm talking about the Sonic 2 movies coming up as well, though. So, it seems like we're gonna have probably merchandise for that as well. Again, they're gonna put merchandise, they're gonna get like a Sonic, like a classic Sonic, a classic Game Man, and like a Silver Sonic. I actually have them like back there on my little carpet, there, right there. so it's actually pretty cool. Um, but yeah. But anyway, it's gonna buy it out anyway, though. Again, like I said, this upcoming Sonic 2 movie, you know, it's said upcoming next year. So, similar like this article I read in the last year, it's 2021, though, going on to 2022. Okay, yeah, it's, Sonic Prime is gonna be on Netflix. You know, everyone in the mall's gonna be watching it anyway, though. So, yeah, they're like, oh my gosh, where's episode Sonic did this and that and stuff like that, though, of course, though. So, uh, yeah, that's it would be, like, you know, pretty cool to go over stuff like that, though, of course. Though. Again, people are gonna be going over that anyway, though. So, um, yeah, it's pretty cool for that, though, of course. Uh, we have, seems like we got some more, um, Sonic Forces for me, right? Sonic Frontiers news right here, so, see, like, from Sega. So like there's no compromise in terms of Sonic quality, I guess. Seems like they don't have, like, the right quality, it seems like it, because, you know, Sonic Forces, uh, so Sonic Frontiers is coming up and stuff like that, of course. Seems like, yeah, the first Japan, you know, uh, let me see, it's, uh, Japan, you know, coming up with a certain you know, game, go be on the first year of sales, because, you know, it's about the Sonic Prime sales and stuff like that, like, you know, like, Forces was, you know, it was good, but it was, like, you know, Kind of play like the main title games and stuff like that. It seemed like they're, they're talking about it because I think that's I said in one of my other videos. I remember lots of the Sonic video. I'm um, going over that like the sales and stuff like that for Sonic and everything. Of course, like I said, you know, it made forces it get sold a lot, but uh, just the game was really, it's really bad. Like we all know, it was really bad. I mean, just for something on Sonic game, it was okay. It wasn't like nothing crazy. Uh, like again, like Code Ultimate was good. Like it really was good. Just some like the graphics and option designs were just really terrible and horrible. A lot of people didn't really like it though. Like you can't change like the music up and down because I heard the music is like, really loud. And yeah, it's really freaking loud though. And some of the remixes are okay in that as well. Like they should get like that, like original soundtrack and no one honestly again like a little update they can honestly just do like probably in the snap. But again, like I said, somebody has to push that update. It's pay like you have to pay a lot of money for that update. People gotta be the families, man. But yeah, it seems like it might not sell well though, but it'll probably sell over a million copies again. It's Sonic though. It's gonna be open world Sonic game. Again, like I said, breaking part of the environment, kinda like Sonic, like you know, Prime coming up under like different dimensions, different shoes and stuff like that. I'd say it's all you gotta really do, like Breath of the Wild has Sonic game. Um, it's gonna be really good. You know, a lot of boom architecture. Look like it has Forces Dance model, which is like a skateboard, of course. But yeah, I guess you're talking about that, like the sales and stuff like that, the quality insurance of, I guess, the um, 
but just like the quality in general, like how it's gonna sell and stuff like that, like you know, number of sales and stuff like that. Of course, yeah, of course, you know, then talking about something like movie, two movie, two movie, basically like, going over that, like it's gonna sell because it's not first time movie actually made a lot. It, like, it wasn't by Sega itself; it was just Paramount, Paramount did. Sega just had the name on it and stuff like that. So nothing crazy wrong there, though. Again, like I said, nothing crazy though. But yeah, uh, Sonic Prime will honestly do. Yeah, they talk about Sonic Prime as well though. Again, the new Wild Brain cartoon they like um, coming to Netflix by um, what was it Man of Brain, wild brain, man of action. So again, we're gonna probably see stuff like that. Like I said, those get help strengthen that. It's definitely gonna help it out because a lot of people are hyped for Prime, including myself. Though, of course, like I said, even in Japan, like the air markets and stuff like that. Of course, um, you know, retailer sales, you know, ten billion and stuff like that. Of course, um, as well as twenty two. Of course, yeah, basically, yeah, forces in Maryland, um, twenty seventeen. I guess, like, yeah, let me see, Japan over Japan twenty twenty two, with the release frontiers as well as case forces. Okay, so. Okay, yeah, um, yeah, just going over, like, the kids and stuff like that, because this, again, this is made for kids at this point, like, this whole series is really made for kids at this point, though, if you say otherwise, you're just, you know, whatever, so, yeah, and you're talking about, like, Nintendo and stuff like that, of course, you know, I had some more problems and stuff like that, like, some more little other things, I guess it's just, just scared, like, I might end up, like, forced, like, it won't really sell well and stuff like that, though, do worry to catch you, okay, so, if someone's watching this or whatever, it's gonna sell well, trust me, it's gonna do really good. Again, it's open world song again, like I said, breaking apart the environment, but the wild style type of gameplay is gonna be looking really, really cool and good though. Oh, for Sonic and stuff like that, of course. Honestly, I think it's gonna do really well. Don't stretch yourself out, don't go too crazy, don't do whatever. Oh, of course. But yeah, it's gonna be looking really good. Again, like I said, it's gonna be really good. Don't fret or you know, threat or whatever, fret. Threat or whatever, just don't go too crazy. Again, the first year of sales probably honestly do good. Other people are gonna be kind of typical slash scared because of course they're gonna get no trailer. Before the game releases again, it comes out later, um, I think what, this year, I think? Holiday, probably like November. I think it, did we already get the release date for it? I can't remember or not. But it's gonna come out, you know, later, like I said, later um twenty twenty um two this year or so. We're saying that now, but um yeah, coming out later this year again, like I say, every holiday. Because again, after forces flopped though a little bit. It didn't really flop, but it just had like it's like when you got to a good parts of the level, it stops. And some of the music, all of the music was just, just synth, it was horrible, like, it wasn't horrible, like, all kinds of music was bad, though, all the remixes were a lot better online, like, Death Egg wasn't, wasn't good, Green Hill had potential, but it's just, like, and, like, the, like, the, not, the instruments were all just bad, though, like, so it was all synth, it all, like, you could hear the synth in everything, and it was, I'll say good, but not, like, you know, it was bad. It was really just was bad in general. That's probably not the music specific, but the Avatar music wasn't that bad. It had something in it too, but it was just mainly just kind of vocal lyrics and like making the Avatar in the game actually probably was the only the best thing. The Moss song was pretty okay. I didn't mind his levels too much or whatever. All his, or literally all his songs were literally were anime openings, okay. but um, everything else though. But yeah, again, I think for for uh, again same time though. Uh, Frontiers will actually do really good in the first year of sales and stuff like that. Honestly, I think it's gonna do really good. Honestly, I think it's gonna do really good though, of course. The Crystal Cut 2022 being the best year of Sonic again. Tell Gachi Zuka said like 2021 and 2020. Because in 2020 again, in 2019, we had like major news block. Like a lot of things got canceled South by Southwest Gaming. A lot of Sonic movie stuff, I think, in Japan got delayed and stuff like that, of course, like a couple months later. It was insane. Like it really was horrible and insane. I got to do like a whole video talking about that back in 2019 anyway. Like I might may upload that video sooner or later. Um again, this is really, like really kind of old in quality though, I think though, so nothing crazy. But yeah. Um, but yeah, it's basically talking about, you know, 2022 will be good progress, of course we got Frontiers, um, we have Prime coming out, and just talking about the upcoming stuff for Sonic, though. Yeah, a lot of Prime news, for, um, Frontiers news in here, though, so yeah, Frontiers still on the horizon, a lot of people are still scared about it. Again, the game will do well, I think the game wants to do well. It's an open world game, a lot of people really want this for a long time. Um, again, like the Sonic, like, Infinity System, you can just open world that. Um, kind of the new, um... Oh, six kind of like you know, little, like a little gameplay piece pieces you can kind of open world that as well. Again, it's, you're free, you're just open to do whatever you want. Kind of like Breath of the Wild. Again, like I said, it seems like it's gonna be like yeah, like game like Forces or Lost World. I just want to fuck that. Lost World wasn't bad. I like the idea of it, like parkouring off everything, the environments, the game looked great and stuff like that. You can go at 60 frames. They made the game go at 60 frames. Like I think this, I think, because Ultimate goes at 60 frames. So we use like a Dolphin emulator pretty much, and that's pretty much selling colors. What we want in a nutshell, though. So, uh, yeah, I can. I was lean over here, but yeah, um, but yeah, um, I think it's you know the gameplay style and stuff like that, of course. Um, yeah, you know, like the debuts and stuff like that, of course. Again, like I said, I feel like Frontier is gonna do really well. Just talking about like all the rumors, stuff like that, of course, going around because people are scared about it. Say so, yeah, like yeah, November or December. Again, if it, again, they want to do a holiday kind of rush thing. They do it every series, game, everything does it. Sonic usually does it a lot, like every like November, like Groundhog Day, November, like like almost like three or four games, like Sonic one, two, three, like forces, like everything, colors, like everything in November, unleashed. Like all of them came out in November. I remember because I was a kid, I, I saw it all. 
So, um, yeah. Like, I was eight years old when I started playing Sonic, though. I played Sonic the Leaf for the first time on PS2. I thought it was horrible that the game was going to change the 360 version, but it did not, though. So, yeah. But yeah, I thought like Forces could do really good. A lot of people were just still kind of scared about it, you know. We don't know what it's about, you know, rumors and stuff like that, of course. But, well, like, like I said, the problem would be pretty good as well. Like, like I said, like I said last year, I could put every Sonic video I probably did, and, like, you know, around me, I would provoke and stuff like that, of course. That's going to be really good. And, of course, we got the official logo set for Sonic. So, this all looks really good, though. Like, this all looks really good. Again, oh, yeah, 69. <laughs> yeah, Canadian, 69.99. So, yeah. It's really good though. But yeah, like I said, actually looks really good. Again, I'm just going with all the pictures and stuff like that, of course. I did like 400 videos on this already. I remember doing back in 2020, um, 2021, I think I did a couple, I think I did like one video for this. Again, a little stuff like that, because like I said, actually looks really good. I think they had like the um, Dr. Eggman, like the Death Egg um, one, that one's different. This one's completely new, the um, Death Egg. Because since LEGO debut was technically in like, what, LEGO Dimensions? Even then, they had like budget out like themes and stuff like that. But also on the other hand, um, yeah, it looks really good. Again, like I said, um, yeah, it's basically just a song like I said, though. But yeah, it looks really good. Like, I like it so far. You got 1,000, um, 200, 125 pieces. Again, like, it do take forever to get done, though. But yeah, you have a, look like you have a cast and rules, um, the, um, that's the egg, come on, the um, ring right there. Looks really good. Like, I like it so far. It all looks really good, though, so. Um, yeah, like, I'm very impressed so far. Like, this is really good because of the trailer right there for Sonic, uh, for Lego set. It looks really good. Like, I like it. Like, this is really good for kids and stuff like that. This is really good. Again, it's crazy. Yeah, it's a chaos Yeah, they are all, what, all seven? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yeah, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yeah, But it looks really good. Eggman looks really great, though. But yeah, like, all of it looks really good. The rubber book, Sonic. Um, yeah, you really can't change on it like that, though. But yeah, all looks really good. Again, 1,200 pieces. 1,125 pieces. It's gonna be pretty much the same, though. Of course, though. But yeah. But I can go ahead and end the video there for sure, though. But again, I talked about everything I kind of really want to talk about. Mainly just, like, you know, the hype up for um, Prime's coming up soon. Uh, of course, like, Takashi Suzuka talking about that. Like, um, for, like Frontier's kind of doing bad. It's good, like, he doesn't want he doesn't want to be another Sonic Force. He did say an interview. I did, like, you know, a video for it months ago. He did state that um, he does not want another Sonic Force just the way it fucked and stuff like that. Again, it, it was okay. It wasn't nothing crazy, though. But again, I guess he doesn't want that repeated failure. It seemed like that. Force wasn't really a failure. I'm not going to say that either, though. It's okay. Again, I'd rather play. Oh, not really 06. No, I'd rather play Force than 06. Uh, yeah, I would play Black Knight. I love actually. I love playing Black Knight. I'm not joking. I literally say it right now. But yeah, like I said, it looks really good again. Sonic's Prime Future, like for like Frontiers' of the Future, is gonna be probably really good again. I love. I know a lot of people get down and they talk about it and stuff like that. Though. Of course, but yeah, a problem coming up soon though. Of course, like I said, um, Frontiers and stuff like that. Of course, but stuff like that though. So yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and end the video for sure though. So yeah, see you guys later though. Thank you so much for watching. Have a great day. Go ahead, all good again though. Be sure to stay safe. Watch friends. God bless all of you. Point out on the math on top of right. So what do, you go, what do you guys think about all this info though? Of course, you like, you hate it again. Very simple, very easy, typical stuff though, of course though, but yeah. Um, I need to go blow my nose, I don't know why it's getting on my nerves in the video though. But yeah, super excited, super hyped. Again, like I said, just talking about Prime coming up and stuff like that, of course. Frontiers, you know, a little stuff like that, statements and whatever. Like I said, it looks really cool. But yeah, it's already in stores. I mean, I was talking about the Sonic and the Death Death one that got, you know, really popular. That's like your local Target, like all the stuff that your local Target. I got like Sonic Knuckles. Again, for Christmas, for me, for this purpose though, so. Yeah! See you guys over there with the note. Peace out.